Tier 1. This is the Motorola Moto G Power uh, 2022 edition. Uh, so, as you can see here, I'm going to be doing a, a 4G LTE speed test to see how the device performs on the Metro Vitic Mobile Network. So, as you can see right now, I'm connected uh, to Wi Fi. So, I'm going to be uh, disconnecting it. Okay. Now, I'm going to wait for it to get connected to the service. And the app that I'm going to be using, it is called uh, Speed Test. Okay, guys, as you can see there, it says Go. And it says here LTE, Metro PCS. So, basically, Metro by T Mobile. Moto G Power 2022. Okay, so now let's go ahead and start. Okay, guys, as you can see here, for the pin, we got 29 ms. So for the download, we got 26.2 megabit per second. And for the upload, we got 9.50 megabit per second. So let's try one more time to see if we get uh, a different results. <laughs> Okay, guys, as you can see here, now that they signed the pin is 29 ms, the download is 20.6 MB per second, and the upload is 10.6 MB per second. So now let's go and take a look at both of the results. And as you can see here, the first time that we did the uh, test, we got 26.2 uh, MB per second, and the second time it went down to 20.6 MB per second. So the first time on the upload, we got 9.50 MB per second. And then the second time, we got 10.6 MB per second. So the results that we are getting, uh, you can call it decent. Uh, it all depends on the area that you are located and also the time of day. Uh, so the speeds can always vary. It can go higher, it can go lower. And also depending on the data cap that you have. Uh, so that's going to be all for this video. So thank you very much for watching my video. If you like my video, please click the like button. You can subscribe to my channel so you can get more content. If you have any questions, please leave it down below. Thank you for watching my video. Bye-bye.